bringing back sports is one thing when we can actually start, the leagues can start playing games. The other half of that is when do you have audiences? When do you have spectators? And I think that's the harder part of this, right? Because yeah. no question. And, yeah, there's no question. That's the hard part because when, when are people going to feel confident enough to go to big, big gatherings, right? And, you know, it's going to be difficult to start off with 25 people, let alone 15,000. And so we're just going to have to de defer to, you know, the scientists, the, the doctors who, t who will tell us what we need to do to get the arenas in shape to be able to accept people and for those people to have confidence. I mean, at the American Airlines Center, we're already talking about not only the sanitation and sterilization efforts, but how can we label things like, you know, chairs or um, escalator handles so that people know that, you know, that they've been cleaned? Or do we do um, an augmented reality software app where people can point their phone at any device in the arena or any, any location in the arena and know when it was last cleaned and what was done to it? If a player thinks that um, they need a mask in order to play, we're probably trying to play too early. There's too much uncertainty. And so I think that'll be a good gauge for us to try to determine what, you know, whether it's time to play. I mean, I don't see us playing with fans, but I think, you know, I think maybe players will discuss it. Maybe a player will try it and then they'll realize how difficult it is, you know, and it won't happen in an actual game. So what's going on in your house today? I'm trying to come up with new things. And so on Shark Tank one time, they had these bubble soccer balls. And so what you don't see, Harvey, is on the floor next to me with a pump that's not, not quite set to work yet. We're going to blow up some bubble, ball, bubble soccer balls and let my son and my daughters and their friends each have one because it's social distancing by definition and take them out in the backyard and let them just beat the hell out of each other in these bubble balls. So, you know, then we, maybe we'll have a bubble ball league and that'll be the first, first sports that come back.